Thomas Gainsborough could almost have observed this scene from his London residence, looking out into nearby St. James Park, or he could have conjured it up with the model landscapes and dolls he used to toy with in his studio, or perhaps he saw it in a dream. Today, the mall has become the broad avenue the Queen descends in her carriage, coming from Buckingham Palace. This picture, already described by critics in the year it was painted, 1783, as very fine and magnificent, was recognized as something new for Gainsborough. It is neither one of his usual portraits with a landscape background, nor a pure landscape, but instead a complex design of rhythmically arranged figures shown gliding effortlessly along the broad paths of a heavenly park. The sky is clear and unclouded. The distant trees seem to sway in a gentle wind, and all the characters are young, elegant, and carefree. The three vertical waves that sweep across the composition made it seem, in one contemporary's words, all a flutter like a lady's fan. The artist most frequently cited as a possible inspiration for this unusual painting was Watteau, the French artist who, 60, 70 years before, had specialized in painting similar scenes of elegant folk promenading in idealized gardens. However, Watteau painted on a nearly miniature scale one of his pictures would fit in a corner of this one. It was not merely for that reason that a contemporary of Gainsborough said, the mall comes nearest to the manor of Watteau, but it is Watteau far outdone. <laughs>